Hello, Cancerians. Happy weekend to you. I miss you guys. So it's weekend time. I'm so happy for us. Cancerians, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. So first, uh, we're going to ask what's coming towards you, what you'll be dealing with facing in your life and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. First, we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently relating to you emotionally, what's on their mind, what they're thinking, feeling at this time, especially in relation to you, Cancerians. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of cancer, for cancer's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming up for cancer in their life? And how is cancer currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Cancerians in their life? And how is cancer currently doing on their soulmate journey? Mm. This one is looking at me very strongly as extra message for you. Oh, Cancerians. Okay. Somebody's thinking of you heavily and wants to come towards you. Somebody loves you deeply, unexpressed love towards you and is planning to return to you. Yeah. With something solid. They slow to action though. So it looks like you've been in separation from your soulmate for a while. This person wants to come back to you because they love you. Maybe they realized after they lost you how much they care for you emotionally. Yeah, they've been holding back. You see? Look at this. They've been holding back communication. There was some kind of deep disappointment in this relationship. Because this stands for betrayal. Like something was hidden. Something wasn't... Uh, expressed truthfully or completely in this situation and that's why the two of you are not together uh, maybe this person didn't tell you how they feel about you how much you mean to them whatever the reason was um, it looks like the two of you are apart right now this person wants to communicate with you they think of you strongly because they're showing up in your reading yeah you see you were hoping that this would be a long-term relationship with this person. Let's see. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Cancerians in their life. And how is Cancer currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Cancerians in their life? And how is Cancer currently doing on their soulmate journey? You're heavily concentrating on your money, your business, your job, work, mm -hmm. stability, financial stability, independence. Yeah, see, this person of yours, you and them split up. You're not together and they're not able to move on with their life. So they took over your reading for some reason. We were going to ask about them in a few minutes, but they're showing up totally in your reading right now. This person is not able to let you go, release you because of how they feel about you. There's a lot of misunderstanding between you two. This shows disagreements, fights, arguments. They want to communicate with you. They want to clear it up. Yeah, I see. This means apologies will need to be spoken in this situation. Yeah, this means apologies, peace offerings, gifts. Yeah, look at this. This person has a lot of passion for you. This is them wanting some kind of new chapter in their life. Yeah, I see. They want to see you. So this person wants to see you, Cancerians. They want to see you. This is beautiful, though. Three of Cups indicates happy energy, like um, uh, spending time together, laughing together, socializing together, eating dinner, that kind of energy. Yeah, this person wants to see you face to face. This also means gifts. Hmm. Wow, something serious happened to split you two up. You see, betrayal is showing up twice. So it looks like you feel uh, disadvantaged and they feel disadvantaged as well in this situation, in this relationship. And uh, recognize that apologies, explanations will need to be spoken. 
This person feels you very important to them. This is the world card, very important. They view you as the one for them. They tell you to cover your reading. This person loves you dearly, but this is love that's not being expressed, that's being hidden, that they love you or still love you. You see, they hiding it at this time. Let's see what's going on here. You know, let's please show us what's coming up for Cancerians and how is Cancer currently doing on their summit journey? Wow, you really are heavily concentrating on money, finances, business, job, and guess what? Success is coming uh, through your diligent work. Yeah, you see money, money coming up for you. Yeah, I see you. Whatever it is you do for a living, you have a lot of passion for it. You're very creative. Yeah, and you're very intuitive. Psychic abilities showing up here. Yeah, which is not shocking. Cancerians. Uh, are very intuitive people. Yeah, all water signs are very intuitive. Yeah, this is your very intuitive, um, psychic, feeling, energy. Now, your person uh, was in this entire reading uh, that we just did. Let's see what's coming up for you, Cancerians. We want to know what's happening for you. Universe, please show us something for cancerians what's happening for the sign of cancer and how is cancer doing how is cancerian doing this one is trying to hide from me let's see you love this person a lot yeah you do you feel enormous connection with them spiritually and emotionally But you see how the water is all over the place, next to the cups, above the cups, between the cups. Um, this has been rather, uh, this has been a connection that has had a lot of ups and downs, uh, highs and lows, like very happy moments together and very depressive moments together. Like you, you didn't feel like you had uh, stability in this connection yeah you see you try to let them go several times and you're not able to either so they also got the six of swords from the smaller tarot deck so uh, neither one of you is able to release the other person because of how you feel about each other yeah you see this is you heartbroken sad quiet, not communicating right now not wanting anyone to know how deeply heartbroken you feel yeah, this is you not showing it on the outside. Yeah, you don't want people to know. So if people who know you well uh, look at you and look at you from the outside, they think you're okay. But really inside, you really, uh, this is you struggling emotionally with heartbreak, trying not to worry people around you. Um, this is you hiding how deeply distraught you feel emotionally. I'm so sorry you're going through so much. Yeah, you see? You really want to see this person just like this person wants to see you. Mm. Because you can't release each other because of how you feel about each other, the connection you still feel. <sighs> this person has a lot of pride. Yeah, it's hard for them to express such deep emotions this is them having a lot of pride they want to take control of this situation wisely uh, to figure out how to proceed towards you correctly without making any waves you see they want to use um, their wisdom to approach this correctly wisely wow Universe, please show us what's coming up for Cancerians and how is Cancerian doing? Universe, how is Cancerian doing? What's coming up for the sign of Cancer? How is the sign of Cancer doing? Yeah, you see, look at this. So, uh, this is you living on bad note together. Yeah, like you guys uh, said things to each other that uh, you may be regretting. Yeah, maybe you said it uh, in anger or frustration, like we all do. Yeah, we all go through that when we 
frustrated when we are arguing. Uh, we usually say things that um, we normally wouldn't say, sometimes to vent, sometimes out of anger. Um, yeah, both of you are uh, analyzing everything that was done and said. Yeah. This person wants to come towards you with some kind of emotional offer, gesture. Yeah, you see, you're very heartbroken because you were hoping that this would end up being a long-term relationship. Lifetime commitment, you see, four of wands. Here you see the nest and the two of birds, two birds representing you and this person. This is you hoping that there will be communication between you two. This is you trying to pick yourself up emotionally. You're still very attracted to this person. You have passion for this person. You love this person a lot. Yeah. But you at the same time very frustrated. You love them and you're frustrated at the same time. Yeah, you see? Uh, they've been waiting on communication from you and you've been waiting on communication from them to clear things up. But look at this. Six swords here and one sword here makes it seven. Seven of swords stands for deceit. So you guys feel uh, like there was betrayal in this situation. You feel like um, they did something wrong. They feel like you did something wrong and you guys uh, haven't communicated openly, effectively with each other. And there's a lot of animosity, maybe uh, misunderstanding. Um, hmm. But at the same time, there's also a lot of love and confusion. Yeah, you see, this is beautiful, though. Something good turning up for you. Wheel of Fortune is very good omen in any reading. This is your luck turning up for you, you see. Beautiful, I'm loving this. Yeah, you walked away from this situation. You did. You walked away from this. Let me see one more over here. Yeah, you see, you were hoping this would be a long-term relationship. Um, that's why it's heartbreaking for you to let this situation go. Let me see what's going on here. Let's see what will clarify this emperor energy on your person. They're thinking of you heavily. They're showing up in your reading again. You know, please show us... Um, What's coming up for Cancerians and how is Cancerian doing on their summer journey? What's going on? What's coming up for the sign of Cancer and how is Cancer doing? Mm. This person is going through major emotional rebirth and spiritual awakening. You see death cards, some kind of changes in this person's life. Yeah, look at this. For some reason, this almost never happens, but for some reason, we pick two instead of one. So this person views you as moving on with your life. They think because your back is turned towards death card, they think you totally let them go, that you release them, that you have no intention of seeing them or talking to them or being with them. That's what they think. They have a lot of respect for you. They view you as very strong-willed, independent, attractive marriage material, taking care of yourself. This person is also intuitive. Did you know? This person is intuitive. Hmm. Yeah, you see? They also see long-term commitment with you. At least that's what they were hoping for. Let me see one more. On this emperor, soulmate of Cancerians. A lot of you are dealing with Aries, Scorpio, Virgo. But they could be any sign really you see so this person is going to find a way to communicate with you this is unexpected communication uh all pages are messengers but page of wands represents messages that are passionate unexpected out of nowhere yeah you guys are not able to release each other because of how strong this connection is and how strong the yeah you see communication and how, how strong the feelings are between the two of you. Cancerians, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about the soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. What are they planning long-term? 
Then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you, what they have up their sleeve, whether they hiding it on purpose or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmates, new chapters, new beginnings in your life, also your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Cancerians, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.